Carlson, and I'm from Denver, Colorado. I was inspired to start 3D street painting when I saw pictures of anamorphic 3D art on the internet, and uh, it blew my mind. You know, I thought it was the coolest thing that I had ever seen, and I, I really wanted to learn how to do it. And so I spent all this time figuring out how the technique worked and honing my skills. And here I am now. Uh, my artwork has changed a lot. As my, as my skills have developed and changed. Uh, when I first began painting, I did a lot of abstract work, uh, a lot of splatter painting, simply because I didn't know how to draw. And as I've learned how to draw, and as I've come to understand light and shadow, my work has become a little more refined. And uh, as I learned anamorphic 3D technique, that's developed as well. Uh, well, I've always been sort of fascinated by optical illusions. Uh, MC Escher is one of my favorite artists. and. When I started seeing anamorphic 3D chalk art on the internet, um, I, you know, it really captivated me. And uh, the fact that there's a little bit of a little bit of math and a little bit of trickery and a little bit of art, you know, it, it all kind of combines, and it's a it's a really cool combination of all those elements. I think the internet plays an amazing role in in my artwork in particular because so much of my work is is only available to be viewed on the internet, only available on YouTube. It's a great way to get myself out there, and because the work is not permanent, I wash it away and I paint over it, it lives on in the internet forever. I like the challenge of size a lot. I think the, the larger pieces are, are much more impressive to the audience, so that's something that's important to me. I get a lot of my inspiration from from toys and from video games, and I'm, you know, I'm still a kid at heart, so that's the stuff that I still like to work with. I like to do, you know, I did a Rock'em Sock'em Robots piece this week, I like to draw little green army men. I love video games, I love Mario, I love everything Nintendo. So a lot of my inspiration comes from the little kid inside of me. From this Atlantic City 3 Chalk Art Festival, I've met a lot of amazing people and I've been able to learn from some of the greatest street painters in the world right now. So tons of experience and tips and tricks, but also a lot of great friendships. When Tracy asked me to be a part of the festival, I was really honored. It's, it's amazing to have someone as talented and, and well-respected in the art community as Tracy ask me to be a part of her team and to participate in something that she's putting together. So I was blown away. I was starstruck. I was, I was really happy and excited.